Today we're going to solve problems that involve more than one step. Some questions have multiple problems that need to be answered before the problem can be solved. Here is an example of one of them. Three girls and four boys went to the movies. The total cost of their tickets was $42. What was the price of each ticket? I find it helpful to underline clue words to help me identify the operations that I'm going to use. Three girls and four boys went to the movies. The word and tells me that I need to put those together, which would make it an addition problem. So three plus four equals seven. So seven kids went to the movies. We know that they spent a total of $42. What operation do we use when we know the total, but we want to find the price of each ticket? That's right, we use division. So we take the $42, and we divide it between seven kids, which gives us six dollars. So the price of each ticket was six dollars. This problem had a hidden question in it. We weren't able to find out what the price of each ticket was until we found out how many kids went to the movies. Let's move on to a more complicated problem. There are five kids playing soccer. All of the kids scored two goals except for two players. The other two players scored the same number of goals each. The kids scored a total of 20 goals. How many goals did the other two players each score? Again, I find it helpful to underline the clue words so that I can figure out which operations to use. And with a problem like this, I also like to draw pictures to help me understand and solve the problem. There are five kids playing soccer. All of the kids scored two goals except for two players. So how many goals did these three players score? We know that three players times two goals each is six goals. The other two players scored the same number of goals each. That information isn't going to help us much yet. The kids scored a total of 20 goals. Let's take those 20 goals and subtract the 6 goals that these kids have. So 20 minus 6 gives us 14. So we know that these two kids scored 14 goals. How many goals did the other two players each score? We know that together they scored 14 goals. So when we divide that by each of the two players, 14 divided by 2 equals 7. So they each scored 7 goals. We had to solve two hidden problems in this question before we could find out how many goals the other two players each scored. Now you know how to solve word problems that involve more than one step.